<laughs> Fish bum. It's fighting like a mutton. Look at the cooter hitting the mutton. Get out of there. Oh, oh. All right, guys. Something a little different this morning. We are going out of Black Point Marina on Marcos's contender. He's got a 30 foot contender. Thing is gorgeous. So, going out of Black Point, gonna switch gears here a little bit. We're going after Mahi and then for a late uh, yellowtail bite. Um, right now, the winds are, I would say, 10 to 15, but they're supposed to be dying 5 to 10. Uh, hopefully, the weatherman was right on this one. Been dying to get out there. He's been dying to run the boat. Has been sitting for a little bit. As for gear, we have our our big anchor setup in case we just want to switch gears and go for muttons or groupers. Um, you never know. Sometimes the current is so hard out there, and with it rolling so hard, you need a lot of anchor, a lot of weight, and a lot of chain. You know, a lot of people just think it's the weight of the anchor and a lot of rope, and uh, that's the farthest from the truth, especially when you get to that. 150 to 160 range so got that got our cooler all the camera gear we got everything all of our tackle it's a beautiful day so right now usually this time of the year um around may you start getting those big bull dolphins uh most of the time you, you'll catch a lot of singles or you'll get schoolies but not small schoolies you'll get good size schoolies let's see what happens guys i'm i'm pretty dang excited we got marcos right here coming up so we're gonna get all this stuff on the boat and see you guys on the flip side feet of water um, saw some really good seaweed patches put the rods in got two rods out one uh, green and blue and one purple and silver skirts for mahi so let's see uh, see what we can come up with we we're kind of looking for birds but then we saw this big seaweed patch and we we're like the heck with it let's put the rods in real quick and do a quick troll oh we're on we're on we're on Oh, it just came off. <laughs> right, look, this dude, it's like you can't even get more precision eating than that right there, boys. Dang it. Anybody with him? Take it out of here. He ate half a squid is what he did. Oh yeah? Yep. I think he's a keeper too. I think he's a keeper. 20, right? Dude. Yeah. <laughs> Here. Oh, camera turned. Ah, hold on. That's right. Yeah, yeah right? Yeah. Yep. Whoop, whoop. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> All right, right man. Right there. Finally got one. Yeah. Man. Dude, my little contraption works. <laughs> you see what I did there, right? What'd you do? You make it? Oh, you... Ow. Yeah, but look how far. Yeah. I put the... Usually the hook would go here. Yeah, like right there. Yeah. I put it all the way back here. Yeah. Let's take a bigger bait. Yeah. Bigger bait? Bigger bait, bigger fish. Bigger fish. There we go. I have no clue. I'm gonna bring it in. We got something on it. Yep. I'm bringing it in anyway. It's something small. It's, it's on it. Yeah. He kept eating piece by piece till he got to the hook. Yeah. No, we got some other one. A little guy. What's up, buddy? All right, buddy. See you in a couple weeks. Come on, come on, come on, come on. So right now we are at 
650 feet. We're following a frigate, and he's on a big school mahi. Uh, haven't seen any big ones yet, but they've all been legal, 22, 24 inches. So can't complain with that. But we're on his trail, and we're giving it all we got. We've got four lines in. We got a cedar plug. We got a skirt with a ballyhoo. We got a regular uh, skirt, no bait on it, and actually it blew, and that's been getting hit more than anything else. Then we have a big green and yellow with a ballyhoo on it. So everybody's been getting love, except the cedar plug, but we just put it in there. So uh, he's still on the bottom, he's still, he's still, yeah. oh yeah, 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 he's still low, he's still low. All right guys, so get back with you. I'll catch you on the GoPro. <sighs> Big old frigate. I don't know if you guys can see it, but he's there. Oh, 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 oh. Get ready, get ready. You on? No, 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 he's just playing with it. All right, all right, all right, all right. Oh, wait, he's playing with it again. Hold on, he's gonna hit. You got him, got him? Woo! Bring it in, bring it in! Sir! Solo? Yes, sir! Solo monster! It's alright! It's alright! One at a time, I'll take it one at a time! <laughs> Boom! We go number five! Woo! Still got it. Yeah, we got that one. Where did he go? All right, all right, all right. Yeah, he pooped all over me. What a pooper. He pooped all over me. What a pooper. That was not nice of him. 600 feet. 600 feet. Man, we've... <laughs> We've caught them in all depths today. Yeah, yeah, 1,200. The other one's 900, that double one. Yep. I forgot what double. Huh? Double lift. Double Just watch that bird, watch that bird, watch that bird. Oh, yeah, I got one too. You got one too? Yeah. Across over here, lovely. Woo! Heck yeah, dude! Heck yeah, right here! <laughs> Fish bump! Yeah. Little guy? Yeah. Take a bloody cooler. All right guys, so we switched gears. We left the friggin' alone, and now we just hit our yellowtail spot. So we're sitting at the yellowtail spot, it's about 80 feet of water. We got the uh, 20 pounds of chum in, and now we're just kind of waiting. The biggest thing with yellowtails, you kind of just want to wait till they chum up and get going pretty good before you really start hammering on them. You know, you kind of want to just have them get comfortable and come in. So hopefully, that's what we're waiting for. But keep you posted. Let's get some yellows on the boat. Oh, dude, look at the size of this cuda. It's Holy got God. it's got my yellow tail. Really? Woo! Well, look at you taking advantage. Already? Yeah, it's already started. Well, I guess then it's time to get this party started. We're hooked up. Come on, come on. Ooh, looks like another big mutton. Man, this rod's getting slammed over here too. Woo! 
Whoa, 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 easy, easy, easy. Oh my oh. god. Ready? In. <laughs> <laughs> Dude. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> Another one bites the tongue. Look at that thing. Heck yeah, man. What a beautiful fish, dude. I mean, you can't. Look at this. Oh, look at big old double hander. Look at the colors on that. Good thing it's a yellowtail spot. <laughs> wow. Hell yeah, dude. <laughs> Woo. A yellow flash. Whoa, whoa, whoa. 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 And there's two kudas, dude. Really? Woo. We got yellow on the boat. Oh, shoot. Uh oh. Well, that's good because he's over here. Nope. Broke off. All right. This is small. Holy. <laughs> Are you carries for it? Oh, look what I got. Oh, uh, this is my favorite fish. The sucky fish. The sucky fish. Oh. Talk about a mixed bag. <laughs> yeah. That won't do it now. There it is. <laughs> That's pretty cool. <laughs> Tell me if you let go, we'll put you back in the water. <laughs> Alright buddy. See ya. You old squirmy worm. <clears throat> Come on now. He's far back. He's coming. What is that? What is it over there? Let's take a big cooter right behind it. Oh, no. oh trigger fish. Oh, really? <laughs> Not even the Kuda wanted it. Kuda was like, nah. Yeah, colors like a trigger. Yeah, that's a huge trigger. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't want that cooter to get him. Yeah. It's fighting like a mutton. Head shaking like a mutton. Yep. Oh yeah, that's a money. Come on, bring that baby up. I just don't want him to spend a lot of time midwater, you know. Here he comes. Let me know. <laughs> Dude. Dude. Yeah, look where you got him. Perfect. You get in the way. He wasn't going nowhere. Dude, holy smokes. We have been on them, on them. What a beautiful fish. <sighs> 19 inches, baby. 19? 19. 19. Ah. Come on. Woo. How awesome is that? I don't know, it's fighting almost like a whoa. Yeah, whoa. Oh! Man, what do you think? Grouper? Huh? You think? Yeah, for sure. Come on. On. I see color. I see color and I see something big behind it. The oh no! Look at the cuda! Look at the cuda hitting the mutton! Get out of there! Oh, 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 oh. get it! <laughs> <laughs> Damn, dude! Bro, I would just throw it, throw it back to him, man. Go ahead, buddy. Look, he got him! He got him! He got him! He got him! Two of them, dude. There's two. Dude, if we had a stinger, oh. set it up with a stinger rig, dude, and hammer on them. Damn. Get him up? I'm trying, dude. Rupert? Uh. Huh? I don't know. Hurry up. 
I think he rocked me. Damn. Look, look, look at the look look at that. A grouper, dude. I I Oh the headline. Dude, they're here. Yo yo. Oh, got him. Got him out. Get him out. Get him out. That's where you going with it. Wherever the hell he wants to go with me. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Holy <laughs> Dude! I thought it was a grouper. <laughs> Holy moly. Dude, we're on fire with these things. Dude, and look what we're using it for hooks. I know, I know, I know. Huh? How does that even make sense? How Dude, does that make sense? That's a big fish. Guys, are you seeing this? Holy smokes, we've been mutton after mutton. Big guys. Put your foot next to him. Look at that. Oh, Holy moly. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Ah. On the floor. No. <laughs> Still good, though. Still good. Yeah, all right. Woo. Holy moly. All right. <laughs> to the cooler you go, buddy. No mess in that one. Nope, no need. <laughs> yes, dude. Oh. No. No, you're on, you're on. Yeah, but. Cooted? Oh, yeah, cooted. Oh, it's coming. Oh, it's a trigger fish again? <laughs> It's your buddy, your one and only buddy. <laughs> your little buddy, Mr. Ooper Ooper. Put him in your lap. Put him in your lap. No, no, no. We're all out of triggers. <laughs> Mutton, baby. Up. <laughs> another, one, another one. It's crazy. Dude. Dude, I would never thought the little yellow tail hooks would be smashing mutton. Dude, that is crazy awesome. We smashed it on the bottom. What do you think? We tore it up. We came to a yellow tail spot, all we came up with was the buttons. Go figure. Hey. Can't complain. We'll take it all day. Caught one yellow tail and I'm talking smash the muns. We probably caught, I don't know, 12 muns. I mean, it well, was like, and we got, broke off probably 10, 12, 14 Bunch of times times. using uh, yellow tail hooks. Go figure, hey, who would have thought? Dude, we're using 15 pound fluorocarbon leader and little tiny yellow tail hooks, little jig heads. And the only way we were getting them is we we're just hooking them right in the corner of the mouth. I mean, some of them swallowed, which I can't believe they didn't cut the line. I mean, yeah, with the teeth. that was kind of crazy. So, talk about a mixed bag. We had trigger fish, we had that uh, remora, right? Is that what yeah, Spanish called? mackerel. That, that sucker fish, Spanish mackerel, muttons, got one yellow tail. That's a hell of a day. I mean, we are loaded down. We probably have a, at least a good hour, hour and a half of cleaning fish when we get back. So, we will meet you guys at the dock. We had an epic day. I mean, honestly. It was awesome. That day, <laughs> it, it was off the rip. It was outstanding. I mean, we kind of knew. I mean, well, we were expecting to catch something, so I mean, we I mean, always hope to catch a lot of The old fish. contender never leaves a skunk. No. That's for sure. What's That's unbelievable sure. today was how we caught Mun Snapper on little yellowtail jigs. Unheard of. I, I've never seen that. I've never done it before. First for me. I mean, that was not, I mean, for as many times as. You've been out fishing your whole life, and I've been out fishing my whole life, especially at that spot. I mean, that's our spot. Yeah. And we've caught hundreds of yellowtail there and used those same jigs, and all of a sudden, to catch all these muttons on a 15 pound leader 15 with pounds. a little itty bitty hook. I mean, that's just, it, it really is unheard of. Right. I mean, that, that we really did 
a, a pretty awesome job bringing them in, especially with all the cooters around. And then to get out there at 1,200 feet, hook some mahi, say our day was over at 11, and then to come in and see that frigate flying with no weeds around. No weeds and saw them and said we had to throw some lines, see what happens. Caught a few more. Like usual, it's just yeah. follow the birds. No, thank God that you had said to let's put that little blue jig in without without nothing, no bait. Yeah. Just didn't. I mean, that, that, that was a savior today. That caught like three, four, yeah. five of them. It was a workhorse today. You know, it really did, man. Well, heck yeah. I hope you guys really enjoyed. We did the time. We got them. Filled the boat full of blood. <laughs> so make sure, drop a comment, hit that like button, and make sure to subscribe. And if you have any questions or we can help you out or you just want to say hey to us, make sure to just drop it in the comments. And till the next time, let's keep it extreme. Let's go.